Hi, thanks for tuning in to doitwithcassandra.com. We're here at Eat Real Fest Culver City 2011. Let's go check it out. Hi, you're joining me here with Andre Lamelli of Gabby's Kitchen, one of my favorite stomping grounds in Old Town Orange. He is the director of marketing and sales, and I just wanted to talk to him a little bit about what Gabby's is and what they have to offer and kind of what's going on. Tell me about Gabby's. Well, Gabby's is uh, originally started as Gabby's Mexican Kitchen, the restaurant in Old Town Orange, uh, more along the lines of a uh, regional authentic cuisine, more cuisine derived from uh, Oaxaca, the Yucatan Peninsula, you know, central Mexico. So we're kind of bringing the unique flavors, the chilies of Mexico to Orange County. Well, yeah, I mean, it's very like, if I was going to describe it just as a patron, if, uh, it's, it's really fresh and it's really... It's not so like heavy hours of sauce stewing, like it's more like the fresh right. kind of... Absolutely, absolutely. And, and we're starting to gear towards more seasonal produce as well. Right now in the summer, we're featuring a lot of squash blossoms with the flowers. I don't know if you've seen them, the tortillas press with the flowers. A lot of corn-based dishes, a lot of fruits like nectarines, apriums, kind of toss it in with our salad. So. Um, so yeah, it's uh, you know that's kind of the direction we're headed towards. You know. So do you have a background in food, or how did you come to Gabby's? Uh, well, I grew up in the business. Uh, both my par my parents own restaurants, my grandparents own restaurants. Um, so I've I've basically worked in the in the business for ten years before I started at Gabby's. I got a degree in marketing from uh, Cal State Northridge, and kind of just combined the two disciplines together, and you know brings me where I'm at today. So how did you find Gabby's? Well, Gabby's uh, through connect friends of friends. I was uh, at the time I was unemployed. I had a college degree, but nothing to show for it. And uh, I started as a social media director, and uh, it just kind of escalated to a, a product line that's now available at Whole Foods, uh, Dean and Deluca nationwide. And we've uh, been involved with our, our local farmers market in the Old Town area. Yeah, that's the Artisan Farmers Market. You can check out our episode about that too, because I'm super excited that that's happening. Absolutely. Uh, we, we were approached by Orange Homegrown, which is the organization that started the entire market. And essentially what we did was uh, recruit the farmers. Gabby and her husband, Ed, recruited the farmers to come in through their connections uh, through uh, the Santa Monica Farmers Market, uh, brought in great farmers. Uh, and then myself personally, I helped market the, uh, the, far the uh, market. Excuse me. Cool. Now tell me about the products that you guys are selling. Well, we have five products. We have uh, three hot sauces, uh, an infused olive oil, which is uh, an extra virgin olive oil infused with a little sautéed habanero, really good, and a uh, and an achote rub, which is a uh, typical rub you'll find in the Yucatan Peninsula, which is a staple of our menu at Gabby's. Now, is the olive oil locally produced, or it's uh, Northern California? Yeah, and uh, that's local enough for me. Yeah, exactly, exactly in the Oroville, Sacramento area. It's a nice uh, Spanish style Arbiquina olive, so it's a little bit has a fruitier nose to it, so it pairs really nice with the uh, with the habanero, which is a tropical chili, as you know. Very cool. Well, I'm excited just to be able to celebrate Gabby's and celebrate something happening right here in our hometown. So, thanks for your time, Andre. Uh, thank you. We'll talk pleasure. soon.